it's the most compelling thing ever watching a rod in the batter's box getting roughly right now about four hundred thousand dollars per hit the world including myself because i love drama i love hype i love suspense i love intrigue and alex rodriguez brings it every fucking night whether it's an epic fail or an epic success and we watch Everything he does, how he snorts his nose, how he moves his nose, how his eyes open, how he just takes his beautiful swing, gets into the fucking box, and you're just seeing you want to watch the first A-bomb from A-Rod. You want to watch that first homer. You want to say, finally, did you see A-Rod hit that fucking ball 480 feet? Well, so far, we're not getting it. So far, we're getting singles. We're getting a lot of walks. They even hit him last night. Hit the fucking guy. Fuck him. But the Yankees are in such a tailspin, such a demise of a proud franchise, that even A-Rod at his best, at his finest, at his competitive number one level would mean cock. Because they really are a subpar team. They really are. And even with arguably the best pitcher in Major League Baseball in July with a .55 ERA, Hideki Kuroda could not save them last night. And again, they are in fucking trouble. There's no help coming. There's no hope for this fucking team. When CeCe's ERA is 7, when Andy's ERA is 6, when Phil Hughes' ERA is 8, are you fucking kidding me? You, what is Nova and Corona supposed to pitch every single day? And again, they're going to put up zeros. They're going to put up zeros because the Yankees cannot score. So A-Rod or not, the Yankees suck cock.